Hey folks, Ceridium T here, and welcome back to Until Then. We are starting up Chapter 2 after it rained, and dang it, Cap, <laughs> you didn't have to pull me into this. Oh no. What have we been pulled into? Hey, exam results are out. Can't wait to see which ones I flopped. Uh, whoop. Wishful thinking. Okay, nice, but which did I flop this time? Ah! When pigs fly, Mark, when pigs fly. Wait, am I not flopping this one? Huh, seems too good to be true. Not mine, and never will be. Did I just really think I could ace this? It's over 30! Alright, English. Ha! Huh. This is my score in a parallel universe. Almost there. I dare underestimate my intelligence. Whoa, is this really mine? Come on, really? You bet. 39. Ah, oh, that's mine. So, but where's the one that's below 30? 47. Aim high, fly high. Don't be good names, keep guessing. Ah, there it is. Of course, gonna go without a flunk worthy score. Can never make up to Mrs. Flores. <laughs> yeah, not bad. Nah, that was just a fluke. Wait, what was that? Oh. Car in the background. Wrong. The notes are lost in this hazy memory. I have to rearrange them. Not how I remember it. I remember, please. He's such a lovely, talented kid. You like it? Focus, concentrate. Piano thing, huh? Oh, you might want to. Though you might want to turn it down. 
If you don't want to look like a possessed idiot. You didn't have to do that. God, you nearly gave me a heart attack. Poor guy. Just you wait, Calf. I'm telling you. Just look at those sunken eyes. I absolutely needed that energy surge. And whose fault do you think that is? Well, well, don't you accuse me of your own wrongdoing. I told you we go early today, and still, chose to sleep late over some lame-ass MMO. Who's the one responsible for dragging me into this stupid plan as I'm here delaying starting this because I was playing an MMO? <laughs> anyway. Yeah, I, 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 yeah, anyway. Oh, right. I wonder who. Oh, you. Hey, look! Go on and answer my question. And the results are out. Mm, let's see. Let's get enough sleep next time, please. Who knows what other creepy shit you'd be doing alone? Ugh, I was. Forget it. Anyone will be here any moment now, and oh, then they'll be uh, like, Whoa, Mike, is that you? Is early? <laughs> Looks like you need another scare to wake you up. I got a 13 on art. A third scare would just be overkill. Hmm, are you sure? I'm wide awake now. Don't you? Yeah. If you say so. What you got there? Well... It's decent. Nothing surprising. Your definition of decent is what's surprising here. Well, unlike you, my bar is higher. To be fair, my bar is higher than yours. Mine's just upside down. Well, I guess they... I can live with this. What? Live with? Are you... Oh, I get it. We're playing the humble game, aren't we? Huh? Well, Cap, look at these. What do you think of my disgraceful scores? Mm, let me guess. The usual 30 to 34 is barely passing. Maybe you got lucky as time and go to 36. I said, look at my scores. Fine! What? 30! What? Uh-huh, you saw that, right? Humbly, I did get a 36. What have you done? Were you sitting next to Lewis? Or did you just cheat? I would never commit such a crime. I'd, unfortunately, finally tried my hand at actual studying. How did you study? When? I don't mean to brag, but it just took two good hours of studying without distraction. All oh, just a day before the exams. No biggie. Remember what I told you last time? About that sleeping genius in my noggin? Yeah! <laughs> and just like that, like a phoenix rising from the ashes, has awakened from its eternal slumber. That's it. Well, eight times over. This is a fluke. Teachers were forgiving. Sims were just too easy. No, they weren't. Period. No, though. I'd argue it wasn't easy at all. Oh, really? Yeah. It was... Speaking of flukes, this stupid plan actually worked. 
Oh, yeah. Hey, hello, and keep it down. Remember, we have to establish a strong connection with the target. The soonest. Weren't kidding. New students do come in early. Newbies like her would want to attract attention. So they can mingle as much as they can before classes start. I really think that being her first new friend is worth sleeping early for? That's correct! You get higher chances of winning your heart. I read that on I read that online, by the way. So why the heck did I get dragged into this if it's just about you? Duh! Cause you're the backup plan! Wait, what? That, that wasn't part of the plan! Wait! Now what? So much for the they want to attract an attention and mingle. Trust me, she might be a meek one. I've done this kind of before. I it as a mouse. Once you get to know her, well, you'd be surprised. We'll see about that. Oh my, she's pretty. Did you see that? Yeah. I can also see where this is headed. I know, right? We'll get together and become good friends. Then I'll ask her on a date. Then we'll watch the stars. Then do whatever they do in the movies. Hate to break it to you, but this is in Hollywood. Now or never, man. Here I go. Great. Hey there! Kate, right? Off to a great start. Uh, I'm Catherine Joyce, but you can just call me Kath. I'm the friendliest one you'll ever meet here, as you can probably tell. Your name's Kate, right? Kinda sounds like mine, you know? What a coincidence! I'm sure that means we'll be good friends. Ah, uh, yes, I know that feeling, my friend. Let's transfer into a new school. I know! You'll get used to it for sure. We're all nice around here. Especially me. I wonder if you haven't had a girlfriend yet. But then I'm one to talk. Oh, uh, welcome to Liam's and Integrate School. This is Class 9 Pearl. Hi, Kath, at your service. Uh, you must be the silent type, huh? I'm the polar opposite of the silent type if you keep talking. It would be very nice of you if you keep that mouth shut. Thank you. I, 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 I said thank you, didn't I? So, welcome to Hollywood, eh? What's the problem? Cat got your tongue? Or should I say, Kate got your tongue? You jerk! <laughs> that joke did not help at all! I've been stripped of all my dignity! Didn't you see? I did. And it was fun. Well, let's see who's laughing now. What are you doing? I told you! You're the backup plan! Who said anything about that? Just face it! Now go and talk to her! Not like I have any dignity to lose anyway. Uh, sorry for the commotion back there. Oh, just my friend who's uh too friendly. She's just like that sometimes. Look, I don't want to meddle in your affairs, but I just hope you have a good time here and feel at home, classmate. I suspected I'm talking to a wall. This is pointless. I'm out. Wait. Go ahead. 
You're afraid to make a comeback? Did someone tell you? Uh, tell me what? About the... The... Never mind. Uh... Wanna talk about it? No. You may leave now. But we just talked. Kind of. I'm not fond of all this yapping. Okay. Name's Kate. That helps shut your mouth. Uh, I'm Mark. Nice to meet you. I guess. And that's our new classmate, folks. Hooray. Man, I don't know what just happened back there. That, that, that ain't fair! I'm the social butterfly here. Not you! I think twice about that title if I were you. What? Just how? She even introduced herself. Even call it that. Now that this mission has failed, would you please let me take a nap? Whoa, Mark! Is that you? This early? The sock in it, Ryan. Hey, dude, that must be Katrina, right? What's up, Katrina? Whoa, you too, Cap? Oh, dude, why are you guys come in so early? Cap? Hello? Yo? Cap got your tongue? Ah, shut up! Wake up, sleepyhead! It's lunchtime. Don't you want to play air piano again? <laughs> Finally! Rise and shine! So how much sleep did you get? One measly hour? Make it two. It's a good thing you got lucky, Tay Jin Jin. What? You slept through three classes in a row. You know, just like Jun Jun over there. I I did what? Why didn't anyone wake me up? Well, we tried, but it was no use. You were in a deep sleep. We couldn't get the sleeping beauty up. And no one wanted to kiss you. So yeah. What did the teacher say? They didn't want to kiss you either. I'm sorry. Am I kissing my grades goodbye? And that's where you got lucky, man! They didn't give a damn. At least for now. What a relief. I swear, just one more warning from Mr. Alfonso. And I'm out of here. He was a surprisingly good mood. They say he got his ex-girlfriend back. Good for him. How about Mrs. Flores? What are you talking about? Art's after lunch break. Hey, speaking of... Quiddy paint. Uh... Paint what? You know? For our poster project? I know, it's so cliche, but man, I did it all on my own. I'm so proud of it. What do you think? 
I think I think I'm in trouble. There's no way! Cramming this is flat out impossible. I have to or I'm getting kicked out for real. Say, how many minutes do I have left? Seven minutes. Are you crazy? I've always been. I know you cram. This is just insanity! Hey! I've just gotta dash my way to the supply store. I can do this! Oh gosh, what am I doing? Oh hey, come back here at once! Can I, like, restart the scene? I think I can restart the scene. Okay, cool. That's my way to the supply store. I can do this. I didn't have a chance to see what I was doing. Uh, that did not work. Out of the way. Out of the way. The heck. We will do this. Maybe. Swerve. Oh, it's like random at the start. Oh, that's what's getting me. Okay. High step. Yeah, we did it! We got through one! Watch where you're going. Sorry, this one's urgent! Nope. Okay. Okay. I want to dodge them all. It's gonna be hard. Dodge left! Who's that guy I almost knocked the tree over? Gotta make my way! Okay. Under! Hey, no running the halls! It's an emergency! I'm gonna paint something so avant-garde and pretentious. I'll knock Floris' socks off. Slow down. Oh, that's the wrong one. Now! Under! Speed up! What the hell? Just dashing through. Aha! I got it! I just splash paint around. And just like that, on the next block! Side step! Watch where you're going! This one's urgent! Target lock, baby! We're almost there! Uh-oh. What are you doing out here? I don't know! Out of all the numbers from 0 to 50, I got a score of 13! I oh, know, my stuff was in French. I forgot to change my, my, my system language off French. No! Okay, I need to look this up. See if I got the right one. Okay, we did it, we did it. We dodged them all. Oh, can this take it any worse? A Mark. Hey, uh, Billy, my guy. What's up? What's the last minute rush today? Anything? Marker, pen, printing, Xerox. I need something. I don't think. I don't think I'm in good shape to cram now. That girl is in, in good shape as well, it seems. Uh-oh. I can sound my own, okay? Hey, AI. Uh. Uh. What? What's your deal? 
Sorry, I didn't mean to. Didn't mean to ruin someone's first day in the school? Okay, sure. Well, thanks, I guess. To be fair, you were blocking the halls. Right in the middle. Wow! So, are we just totally ignoring the fact that someone was ruthlessly barreling through the halls? I know. Sorry, you're in the wrong too. I lost my consciousness for a moment there! You almost killed me for Pete's sake! Hey, I I'm... Look at this mess! Look at me! I'm a mess! This is... I was so excited to... to start a brand new life here! And you're just gonna... You're just gonna mess it up like that? What am I supposed to do? Whatever. Never want to see your face again. Great. Both of you. Principal's office. Now. Oh, we're in trouble. We're in trouble! Fortunately, we have some extra uniforms for students. You ought to return them next week. You understand? You two realize the consequences of your misbehavior? Let this day teach you a well-deserved lesson. Very. You will stay here until dismissal. I've called the principal. She'll be here in a few hours. Wait a second. Have I seen your face here before? Uh, uh me? Yes. Uh, I have no idea what you mean, Ms. Legaspi. I knew it! Just how many warnings do you have left? Before you get expelled? I don't know. I'm invincible? Hey, uh, Andy? You want one? Min? Brew? Who was I thinking? Candy won't be enough to tame the beast. There's gotta be something in here. Um. Can we taste some fancy schmancy coffee? Oh, lift your spirits up. Hi, welcome to Starbunks. What can I get for you? You know, they've got a coffee maker with a grinder here. Top of the line gear. They've got Ar Arabic beans too, or whatever. And cream of the crop. You won't find this anywhere else. It's Arabica, you jerk. Hey! Now we're talking. So you want a cup of Arabica? This is the best coffee you'll ever have. Promise. My hipster friend would kill for this. I'll take that as a yes. It smells so good, doesn't it? Nearly done. I know you can't wait. One cup for you, and one cup for me. Mm-hmm. Never disappoints. Don't let that specialty go to waste. You don't always get a chance to taste overpriced tuition. That's where it all goes. Come on, before it gets cold. Maybe she'd rather have iced coffee. What's to the right? Humidifier, that. Pictures. Oh my gosh, there's stuff all the way over here. I won't be surprised if Jun Jun takes the gold medal home too. Watch this. Useless but fun fact. Our lavish principal 
has three cars. A pickup. A sedan. And an SUV. What you just heard was the SUV. I love it. it has the best beat. Not interesting enough for her. Oh, went downhill from there. Whoa, this one's new. I haven't seen this before. You look at this bad boy. Hey, look! It's not severing my arm. It's just amazing what overpriced tuition can buy. Apparently, bladeless fans are unexciting. Oh. Greetings, home, Liam Sonians. I just want to announce that you can never get rid of me. Can't keep this school running with my pockets as deep as the Marianas. No matter how many times you detain, warn, or punish me, I won't ever have the balls to let me go. I may not be a genius or a dreamer, but I've got epic bangs. That's all for my beloved school. Thank you for your attention. Too bad, security cams. Don't record audio. What an audience. I'd at least appreciate a round of applause here. I tried everything now. Forget it. This is useless. Give up. Is there a way I can not? Give up. Anything down here? No, I guess I give up. Cool. Cool, cool. I give up. I could all I did all I could possibly do. Nothing could make you speak. Beside stupid Arabic beans. Oh wow! Would you look at the time? It appears we have three more exciting hours left in prison here with nothing to do. Except, you know, socialize like humans do. If we would just all cooperate. You do not deserve my cooperation. Finally! Thank God! What are all I've done to cheer you up? Oh, I'm sorry. After what you have done? Either way, try harder. I'm sure you'd die trying. You haven't even taken a sip of my coffee yet! That'd surely calm your nerves, miss. Mister, you're dodging a real issue here. You're just wasting my time. I told you. You were literally taking up half the width of the hallway. Even worse, right in the middle! And you were running. Read the handbook, section 7.4. For a novice like me knows more. Eh, I suppose a veteran. Whoa. Look who's so gung-ho about transferring. She knows the handbook like the back of her hand. Why, thank you. That's what the back of my hand is for. The front is for, you know. 
dealing with you, just in case. If you didn't know, normal people would do their business at this side, at the side, to make way for others. But I guess some people simply aren't part of that population. Sir, have you ever heard of speed limits? I think someone here could take a page from traffic etiquette. Not getting that show on the road, huh? Well, ever heard of middle lane hogging? Go ahead, take a page. Oh my, get the show on the road? <laughs> you just use an idiom literally? How oh, cheesy. Actually, that was a double entendre. I, I used the idiom both literally and as intended. Too bad my ingenuity went over your head. I wish ingenuity were in an, a an antonym for genius right now. I'm running out of fuel. Because that was lame. I admit it. Your car has crashed. Is it my fault your car crashed into mine? Flat tire. Huh? What's that even supposed to mean? I said you're a flat tire. What? Oh, you monster! You really want to get it, do you? I'd be flat tire. Uh, flat turd. <laughs> you dirty sicko! <laughs> Uh, I'll talk to you later. Uh, good af- uh, good afternoon, uh, Mrs. Chavez. Good day, Mrs. Chavez. Looking fancy today. How are we doing? Of course it's you again. Although it's the first time you brought someone with you. I, uh, I sincerely apologize for the trouble. I hope we can resolve this ASAP. Whatever. I'm in a hurry. Come on, follow me. Okay, let's begin. Mrs. Legaspi has told me everything. I have to say, what you've committed is one serious offense. Serious indeed. <sighs> but it's his fault. Hold your horses, miss. You'll get a chance to speak up later. Understood. I'm sorry. Let's hire. Come again. Your sedan. I think it has a flat tire. How do you know? Oh, I just saw it earlier. And? There was a flat tire. So flat you wouldn't be able to drive it. That sounds horrible. I have to get that fixed. Absolutely. That's it! Miss? Where are your manners? It's his fault! All his! He was blazing through the hallway without a care in the world! Mister, no running the holes! We made that clear in the handbook, didn't we? You guys did make it clear. Props to you for that. Four thumbs up. A little missy here was blocking the middle of the hallway. Oh, miss. I'm sorry, but you can't do that. You should have known to give away, to give way, right? No, but look. Isn't it clear who should be held accountable? Clear as day. If he weren't running in the first place, none of this would have happened. Same outcome if she weren't blocking the hallway. Plus, you wouldn't have annoyed a bunch of your schoolmates. Pretty sure you annoyed a bunch of them along the way, too. You just don't want to admit it. Silence! I've had enough of you, too. I'm calling your parents now. Oh, please. Just transfer here. Be so... No. Please don't. Don't look at me like that, Mark. You surprised me. Mark? Well then, you don't want me to call your parents. For the love of everything good and holy! 
Just make up with each other. What? How? Figure it out, or I'll call your parents now. I've got a mall wide sale to catch, so make it quick. Hmm. Okay, fine. I'll cover everything. I'll pay for the repainting of the walls and flooring. That's good. I'll get you a cool gift, too. Because I love the school and I love you. Don't have to. Okay. And lastly, I'll help redo her poster. I'll help little Missy here redo her art poster. Which I obliterate a bit. That sounds like a good plan then. It covers everything we'd otherwise worry about. My pleasure. But Mark, I've been hearing about your grades. Remember, you can't make up for that in any way. You have to study harder if you want to stay here. Yeah, I will. I'm gonna miss you guys if I leave. So miss, how does Mark's plan sound to you? Uh... I can take it, I guess. Alright! You two may go home now. Wait, what about schoolwork due today? Turn them in next week. Your teachers will understand. Awesome! More time to do that stupid art project. Uh, I guess. Okay, this is my final warning. Mark, please don't run in the halls. Miss, please don't block them. You two will... Do you two understand? Understood, Mrs. Chavez. It won't happen again. Yuppers! Meeting adjourned. Be safe on the way home. So, uh, that happened? You got away with it just like that? Just like that? Cool, eh? For the record, since you still ruined my first day, I'm totally not forgiving you. Cool. Not yet, that is. They never bothered to ask your name, so what is it? As much as I hate to introduce myself to you, I'm Nicole Loxamana. Uh, uh, you can call me Nicole. <laughs> nice to meet you, Nicole. Disgusted to meet you, Mark. So, what are we gonna do? He needs a little help back there. You carried all of that, Mark? For me? Aw. You forced me to! Oh, you. You're, so, you're such a gentleman. Not a lot of gentlemen these days, you know. Why'd you even shop this much? Thought we were just gonna buy art supplies. You, you really need a new toothbrush holder? Uh-huh. We buy one every week. Well, the house ghost keeps stealing it. And all these plastic hooks and clothespins? Why, yes. I collect clothespins as a hobby. There's a uh, sub get it for that. And all these skirts and shirts? Really? Have you been wearing the same set of clothes every day? You absolutely not. I'm not as filthy as you. And seriously, a knife set? I'm gonna need more than one knife if you misbehave. Let's just get this over with. What's taking you so long to open that door? You're nagging. Welcome to our home abode, which we shall explore next time. Thank you for watching. Uh, thank you to Maximum Entertainment for the code. Um, enjoy the video, consider tossing a like, comment, and or subscription, and click the little bell. Also consider checking out the uh, description for a bunch of links, social media, Discord, all that. And until next time, this is Renium T signing out. Bye!